guys welcome back to my channel so i'm in my i'm actually at my aunt's house which is why this background is different this is actually my old bedroom um but anyways so basically this is i am nine days out from moving and i have bought big things so i've bought my bed which is being shipped to my apartment i have ordered my desk ordered my desk chair and then i'm getting my um my dresser from ikea when i move when i get there and then um i haven't ordered my mattress yet but i'm gonna order it promise um but yeah so i just wanted to like start this kind of off like with just like clips of me but i'm gonna start my move my moving vlog with a couple clips of me before i move they're not gonna be long clips maybe a minute maybe two but yeah i just wanted to you know come on here but yeah guys i'm freaking moving i'm I'm shook. I'm shook. I'm moving. And I'm moving out of state. Um, so I will be, me and my mom are going to be driving to Kansas. And yeah. Oh, now you guys know what state I'm moving to. I'm moving to Kansas. So yeah, it's going to be an interesting journey. And I'll see you guys in the next clip, which will probably be me leaving. Or if I do put in a clip, it'll be my going away party. Um, so yeah hey guys so <sighs> i'm packing up my car because i'm leaving on friday and i was just like let me just pack my car to see how much space i have left like how much more how much more stuff can i bring with me now i didn't pack my boxes hella heavy because i'm like i gotta carry these motherfuckers up the stair i'm not packing heavy boxes um, but I mean, I still pack them. Most of them, my boxes have clothes in them. I have two suitcases full of clothes, and I think I brought two of these. <laughs> and I don't, and I think one box has shoes in it. And I don't think I have enough shoes for me to really take. So, I don't know, I'm gonna try to take, like, I have, a, I, have a couple, I have three baskets that are in my closet. I'm gonna take one basket and kind of just fill that up with shoes, like with regular shoes, and I think I have some flats. It's not, I can just buy some flats for law school. I'm not tripping, <laughs> honestly. I'll just buy them, it's not that big of a deal. Um, if I need some of them, but I just wanna bring some more tennis shoes um, because I think the ones I brought are not like tennis shoes, tennis shoes. I think I just brought like my, whatever I had downstairs already, I kinda just packed those up. Um, I need still need to pack a couple of my sandals. I have my Birkenstocks, so that's for surely going. Cause I packed, I bought some fuzzy ones. I don't know if I showed you guys those, but I'll show you guys later. It'll, so I'll show you guys later. They're cute. They're like, um, maybe I can find a chat so I can find a picture online and post it somewhere right here. Um, because they're like, the regular Birkenstocks, right? But on the inside of the Birkenstock, it's fur. Fur, guys. I'm, uh, okay. And I'm just like excited to wear them. I'm going to wear them in the fall. Like when it starts to get a little cold, I'm going to be like, oh yeah, my little fuzzy Birkenstocks. Um, but yeah, I, <laughs> Let me just show y'all my car. And honestly, I made the mistake of buying a lot of stuff while I was still here. And I should have just, like, waited and then had it shipped there. But this is the thing. Every time I would, like, look at something and put it in the car, it would always sell out on me. And it would take, like, weeks for it to re replenish. And I just didn't want to take that chance of it, of it not being in stock. So, yeah. Like, this is, like, a cooling towel because it's really hot. Um, and I was moving a lot of stuff, but let me show you guys my car. <clears throat> and yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna just make this a separate video or like put this in like the first part of my moving vlog because we are going cross country. I'll probably just make it into two parts. I, I don't know. I haven't really decided. Hey <sighs> but yeah. <clears throat> so what I actually am bringing with me from my house are. My comforter, I have one sheet set that is in a box. I know it's in a box. Um, which box? I don't know and I probably should check because. Oh, this is my pillows. Yeah. Not like my pillow that I sleep on, but like my decorative pillows. And one of these, like I have one in a box that so just don't fit. I turn the light off. It just doesn't fit. Let me show you. My car. <laughs> so, 
I have box. I have a box here. I have like an under storage, like a uh, sink, sink storage thing that I got from Ross. Here I have two of them, so I one, so one on the other side. But okay, so this is my little suitcase, and then there's my big suitcase, mind you, full of clothes. And then I have boxes. This is one of my duffel bags. I have another one that's upstairs. I have more stuff here. And then I think one of those boxes is actually my bathroom stuff. And then I have more bathroom stuff. I have my end table and the plates in that thing. Did you have a new little storage organizer? And then there's my chair. Okay, so mind you, my mom was like, oh yeah, um, ooh, loud. Yeah, I, I kind of bumped into the fucking thing. I bumped into the thing. Mom was like, make sure you pull your car up heck of close to the front of the garage. See, it's like, you couldn't even lift my trunk if you were to try to. Um, but yeah, that's the one today is Monday. I am actually currently charging my camera so I can use that on the actual trip because I don't want to use my phone because my phone will be used for probably GPS and for music and I still need to just stuff okay so let me show you what I still need to stuff inside of my car and by stuff I mean literally stuff um so I need stuff this duffel bag which is like gonna be the clothes I'm actually taking with me to change into. And then this pillow and this pillow are gonna be stuffed in out of there too. Any other clothes? Um I'm mostly coming back home sometime in August. I'll just stuff it in there. But I mean I, I was planning on leaving a lot of stuff too. All this stuff here, still in here. I was planning on leaving anyway, so this stuff is all staying. And when I said like, when I'm thinking about taking one of these and just emptying it out and then taking a couple of my shoes, like maybe my pink shoes, um, taking these flats right here. And then um, I think from, I don't think I'm taking anything from out of this one because yeah, I don't think I'm taking anything out of that. And then that's like not in counting because then I have my backpack and my backpack will have my notebooks, pencils, pens, highlighters, planner, um, and then like my electronics. So like my chargers, my like phone chargers, my camera chargers, my laptop chargers. It'll have all of my chargers in that backpack because I can put that in between my legs um, or stuff it somewhere. So that's not that big of a deal for me to have been done. Also because I'm still currently still using my thing. And then I'm gonna just buy a new one of these like 360 um, chargey things. So I can get that at Bed Bath and Beyond. So I'm gonna just buy a new one of that. Like I'm not taking it with me. Um, I was originally going to take one of my three drawer organizers, but that's not happening at all whatsoever because I can't fit it in my car. So that's staying um, here also. So yeah, I asked my roommate if she would maybe have any room in her car 
for me to fit three of my boxes. Um, and if not, I'll just have to ship it. I don't even think I can fit my espresso machine in my car. I'm gonna try, but I don't think I'll be able to, which is gonna suck because I really want to bring it. But hey, because my roommate is bringing her Keurig, so I mean, you really don't need to. But yeah, that's that's what's happening now. Sorry, it's, yeah, I might have my fan. I'm not turning it off. Um, but yeah, that's it for this little catch up. Um, and I'll see you in the next clip, which will probably be me leaving. And then from there, I'll probably start a new vlog of just traveling. Or if not, I'll just insert a little, little baby clips of me traveling. We'll, we'll, we'll figure it out, guys, okay? Good morning. How are you? Well, it's not really morning. It's afternoon now. But hello, hello, hello. It is the day before I leave. Um, yeah, so let me tell y'all what's ha been happening since the last time I checked y'all in, which I think was Monday. Okay, so yesterday I went by my aunt's house, said bye to my aunt and my grandma, well, one of my aunts and my grandma, and then um, as I was leaving, my check engine light came on. Now, mind you, with my other car, since I got it, apparently I got it two years ago, two years ago, um, the same light keeps coming on, um, and it flashes, says engine off. It's been doing that every three to three to four months since I got the car. Three weeks ago, I took my car into the shop. They did a full workup of it, like I took it to the dealership, okay? So they did a full workup on it, and long story short, they fixed it. They didn't. And now this time it's like some type of ball chain, time change. I don't really fucking know. I really don't care. Um... It's not fixed. So what they thought they had fixed, apparently they hadn't fixed. Um, that's not really my expertise. But yeah, so that's what happened. I bought my very first car yesterday. Um, it's like all the other cars I've had my mom has um, always paid for. So yesterday I bought my first car. So that was definitely an experience for sure. Would I recommend? No, would not recommend. 10 out of 10, do not recommend that. It's not. Mm -mm. And that's something I would recommend doing, okay? So, anyway, got a new car. So, I had to repack my car because when the people packed it for me, they didn't do that good of a job. So, I repacked it. And y'all, this car is the same car, same same type of car, but um, it's 2020. Um, if you guys, I will be doing a car tour um, once I have moved to Kansas and have taken all the stuff out of it. Because right now, well, I mean, I guess you guys see now because actually seeing how much stuff I have packed and how much stuff I can still pack in it is probably helpful to some people. Don't know, but I'll show you. Um, I'm just running water. I'm making some eggs, but boiled eggs but let me show you guys let me show you okay oh hello mother take the eggs off huh? take the eggs off take the eggs off yeah okay. it was 20 minutes uh, no I did and I'll check it after I come back oh ah. I'm vlogging. But yeah, okay, so. Y'all can't really see from here. I gotta get in the front. So can see how well I packed this car, okay? So from my side, you can't, well, from the passenger side, you can't see in the back. Okay, but I did that on purpose because I don't need to see behind me. But from the driver's side, you can see. Now, y'all seen in my other car how packed my car was. So... You can see now how not packed it is. I could fit at least two, two, three more boxes. Can I have four boxes that um, I was going to ship to myself? But I guess now I'm gonna do that. <laughs> so, I mean, 
that's a plus, right? You think that's a plus? But yeah, so that's my new car. And I will do a tour later. But yeah. 